Okay, this is section uh, four, three, dividing polynomial, algebra two, page two forty two. Okay. Are we so, skipping four two? Yes, we are skipping four two. All right, all right. So we're going to look at division of polynomials. We already talked about adding, subtracting, and multiplying, and now it's division. Okay, so we're going to look at several kinds of division. The first type is a polynomial divided by a monomial. And you're, like, you're going to like those, except for oftentimes those are the ones that are missed the most because we, um, we don't study those as much. So it's a polynomial divided by a monomial. And then we're going to look at um, a polynomial divided by a polynomial. I'm abbreviated there. Okay? And this one, uh, we use uh, long division. And I'm just going to tell you right now, you're not going to like that because I, I've never met any student that really did like long division. And then we're gonna do this thing called synthetic division. Oops, I spelled it wrong. Yeah. How's that? Synthetic division. And that means it's man-made. So it's, it's more of a, you have to learn how to do it. Uh, and I, I don't tell you why it works, you just, it works. Okay, so we'll start with the polynomial divided by a monomial. Uh, and I'm just going to show you, use an example, how this works. Uh, let's say that we have a polynomial 6x to the fourth, y to the third, plus 12x to the third, y squared, subtract 18x squared, y, all over 3xy. Uh, so we have a polynomial divided by a monomial. So the first thing is change all subtraction to addition. I think that works best. Okay, and then you break it up so that it's every polynomial, every uh, polynomial, every member of the polynomial divided by this monomial. So it's six x to the fourth y to the third over three x y plus twelve uh, x to the third y squared divided by three x y plus negative 18x squared y over 3xy. Okay? And you just cancel like you would normally. So 6 divided by 3 is 2. Uh, 4 minus 1 is x to the third, and then y squared plus um, 4 x squared y plus a negative 6x. And I don't need the y because if you subtract, it's uh, 1 minus 1, which is 0. Okay. Now, uh, that works great when this uh, is smaller than all 3, but sometimes you get something like this. 3a um, squared b uh, minus um, uh, 15a to the third b to the fourth over, okay, Let's go 9a cubed b squared, okay? The same principles apply. We do plus a negative, okay? And uh, I'm going to go this way since I'm running out of space. I wish I would have gone this way up there. But I take this term over this term, and I do a negative 15 a cubed b to the fourth over nine a cubed b squared. Okay, John, are you okay? Yes. Now you'll see in the first one, John, that we have one third, and then if you subtract, you have a times a to the two minus three, correct? Yes. And then uh, I'm going to run out of room. I let's move it down below. I'll do it here. One third uh, times a to the two minus three, b to the one minus two. Is that correct? Plus a negative fifteen over nine. Uh, divide them both by three. I get a negative five over three times a to the three minus three, and the b 
to the 4 minus 2. Is everybody in agreement with me? Okay. So what I end up getting is 1 uh, one third times a to the minus 1 times b to the minus 1, correct? When I change this to plus a negative, plus a negative, plus a negative, and then plus a negative 5 thirds uh, a to the 0, b to the 2nd, correct? So I get um, 1 over 3ab plus a negative 5b squared over 3. So it looks a lot different, doesn't it? Any questions? Okay. So that is a polynomial divided by a monomial. The next we're going to do a polynomial divided by a polynomial, and we're going to do long division. Now I'm going to just warn you that long division is never fun, okay? Uh, but it, it is necessary uh, in some cases, okay? Uh, I'm going to take an easy one first, and then we'll work. I'm going to work over here and then over here, because they take a long way down or normally they do. So I'm at number three. And let's say that we have a problem like this. x squared plus 3x minus 40 divided by x minus 5. Okay? We have a polynomial divided by a polynomial. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you long division. Okay? I'm going to put this underneath the box. Okay? I'm going to erase and try that again myself a little bit more room. Okay, now this is in decreasing order of x, correct? So x squared, x to the first, and x to the zero, right? If they skip one, you have to put it in. So let's say that we went from x squared to minus 40, and they skipped an x term, you would have to put a zero x term in, okay? Because you've got to have all the terms all the way down. And I'll, I'll try to find one that does that. Okay? Notice I change all addition to, excuse me, all subtraction to addition. And then the x plus a negative 5 out here. You see that long division is not friendly, is it? 